This is Johnny Nelson, and you're watching Sporting Icons. So Nigel Benn versus Sakio Bika is now off. And this is due to Nigel Benn sustaining an injury. He had a cortisone injection in his right hand, and he was due to spar Craig Spider Richards, who of course is a regular at the matchroom gym where um, Nigel Benn is currently training. And he can't throw the right hand, so he's had to pull out of his fight with Sakio Bika. Now, it's not just the pull out, and he's not gonna reschedule. In fact, he's now calling it quits. Um, he's not going to get back in the ring, all that kind of thing. And as he said, he's passing the baton over to uh, his son, Connor. Now, a lot of people will be like, yes, this is great news. He shouldn't have been fighting Sakio Bika anyway, for a couple of reasons. Number one, he's 55 years old. Number two, Sakio Bika, who's 40, there's a very good chance that uh, Nigel Ben could have got seriously hurt in that fight. Because while Sakio Bika, he does pretty much fall at every time he steps up to the kind of level of when he fought like Joe Calzaghe and Andre Ward and these kind of guys, he comes up short. But against Nigel Benn, I think a lot of people may have tipped Sakio Bika to be the favourite in that fight. As Nigel Benn hasn't had a fight in 23 years, Sakio Bika only two years. But either way, um, that's what's happening, that Nigel Benn has now pulled out of his um, fight, which was meant to be on an interview, a internet pay-per-view. That fight will no longer go ahead and he will not reschedule to be facing Sakio Bika. I mean, hold your breath because, I mean, he did say that this is all about closure for him. And obviously, he's not getting that closure that he says that he wants. So maybe he may come back at some point and try again. I don't know. But ultimately, when you're getting injured, as any professional fighter gets injured, it will take a bit of time to get over that injury, especially with um, um, if you're needing cortisone injections in, um, into your hand. But when you're 55 years old, you're going to be healing a lot slower than um, a lot of active athletes. So anyway, that's what's going on. Nigel Benn is now officially retired. Drop your thoughts below, click thumbs up, subscribe. Catch you all on the next video.